I am sorry it took me so long to get this other video out. Uh, this is kind of the continuation of the one you guys watched uh, here just a little while ago, uh, a couple weeks, I think. Uh, it's, it's 16 days in a wake up, I think, maybe 15. Things are happening pretty fast. It's just crazy between work and trying to get things packed and organized and cleaned up and stored. Uh, I don't have a lot of uh, free time to do stuff like this. Uh, my free time comes in the next couple weeks, but uh, this video is to continue on and tell you how things are going to be changing for me, uh, hopefully uh, uh, employment-wise. Uh, the last couple years, uh, I've been doing okay, but my life has kind of drifted away, at least my summertime life has kind of drifted away from what I intended it to be, and um, I, I wish to change that and get that back on course. Uh, on the other hand, uh, I was allowed to make inroads into uh, improving my life out in the sticks uh, more than I would have if I would have taken my original course. So it, it, things probably worked out on the fact that I'm a couple of years older and um, you know it bothers me a bit more than it would if I was in my 30s but I think a lot of you guys understand how that is. And, uh, waiting for next year to do something really doesn't thrill me all that much. I'd rather do it now. But anyway it worked out the way it did. Um, but as many of you know uh, I've been living on a very basic uh, lifestyle, income, subsistence kind of thing for a while now. And while it's, I'm not complaining about that in the least, I love my lifestyle, uh, I'm just not producing uh, what I think I should as far as income and lifestyle and things like that. So I really need to refocus. Uh, and I've done a lot of soul searching and study and uh, uh, come up with a plan which seems kind of counterintuitive to to what I've been kind of preaching because what I'm going to do is I'm going to exploit my lifestyle but I'm going to hopefully do it in a very honest and sincere way uh, because I don't want to be one of these people that uh, exploits the Alaska lifestyle uh, just for the drama and the, the gee whiz gee golly kind of stuff uh, there are too many good people that live up here uh, out in the sticks there are being trashed honestly be, because of uh, the reality TV thing and I don't want to harp on the reality TV stuff but if I'm going to uh, make a living uh, theoretically uh, doing what I love to do which is, is being a mountain man you know uh, I want to do it in, in an honest way and uh, what I've decided to do it's kind of a three-pronged attack uh, the first thing I've decided to do uh, is to become an Amazon affiliate and the reason for that is because Amazon uh, while I know it's a big you know whoop de doop de uh, corporation they're my Sears Roebuck catalog and my JCPenney catalog I still buy a lot of things online simply because these individual purchases are too expensive to do uh, in the winter time if I have to go to uh, Anchorage or you know, Wasilla or any place like that uh, with gas prices and stuff like that and travel time it's just not economical so what I do instead is I buy a lot of stuff online and honestly Amazon has pretty much everything and pretty much everything is shipped either free or very inexpensively especially when you factor in you know travel time and gasoline and stuff like that uh, I don't go to Wasilla uh, I never go to Anchorage but I never go to Wasilla unless I got you know four or five six hundred dollars in my pocket to spend just because I want to make the most bang for my buck. I just don't drive down there for you know Taco Bell for, for crying out loud. But um, that's that's the gist of it. Uh, the way the uh, Amazon affiliate works is that I'm going to be making more of these videos, uh, reviewing and testing the, the equipment I actually use as, as a, a trapper, mountain man, homesteader, that kind of thing, and um, the reviews will be online, people will see uh, the reviews and in the comments section or the, the description section uh, there will be a direct link to Amazon from my video. If you click on that link, uh, for example, uh, let's take this knife for example, this uh, uh, Mora Niv, I think it's Mora Knife, Mora Niv, I, I don't know, uh, Mora Companion, this is their you know El Cheapo knife, this is a $13 knife uh, on Amazon Prime. Very, very inexpensive. It's no thing of beauty. Uh, carbon steel blade. They do make a stainless steel version. Uh, 
I absolutely love this knife. This is my all-time favorite knife for doing almost everything. Um, I did a cheesy little video on it here a while back. doesn't show my face because I had this big honking cold sore. But uh, uh, if you click on that link uh, and go to Amazon and buy, you know, this knife or even uh, a similar knife, uh, I get a sales commission for that knife. Uh, anywhere from 5 to 10 percent, something like that. So I'm working for Amazon, but I'm also hopefully uh, recommending a product to you that I really, really believe in. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to recommend uh, a pair of boots to you that I don't uh, have faith in anymore, like um, Herman Survivors, for example. I'll do a review on them, too. That's very scathing. But as well as uh, this Milwaukee um, Impact Driver, and uh, I have the, the drill as well. Now, what was a what would a homesteader do with uh, sorry about the airplane? What I need one of these for? Well, I don't have electricity, so battery operated stuff is pretty important. And I've used an awful lot of brands of drills and impact drivers, and this one is my favorite. And uh, this is the one I purchased because of uh, a person I worked for. I was very, very impressed with this, so I'm doing a review on this as well. But if you were to go on Amazon and buy this off off of my review, or the similar one, uh, you know, or maybe the upgrade or whatever, um, I get a sales commission for that. So I'm not um, uh, asking for handouts or anything like that. I'm just saying, hey, take a look at this, buy it. And if you do say, hey, that's pretty good, and you buy it, I get a sales commission for that, and it allows me to make money year-round. Okay, part two of my insidious plan to not starve is to offer uh, items that uh, uh, grow in Alaska, uh, like this chaga here. Uh, chaga to me is, uh, is a great medicinal tea full of antioxidants, uh, basically a cancer fighter. It also, for the ladies, is a great astringent, and ladies know what the ast an astringent is, so I'm not going to describe it and bore the guys. but. The ladies, if you ladies, if you brew this into a tea, wash your face with it. You're gonna love it. Um, it tightens pores and uh, reduces wrinkles. There, I said it. Anyway, I will be offering this for sale uh, online as well. Um, I haven't decided if I'm gonna do it wholesale or not because the wholesalers around here and there are people that buy it uh, just don't offer enough to make it worth my while. Another thing I'm gonna be doing is I shudder to mention it. I'm going to get back, be getting back into leather work, and I've only been doing leather work for myself uh, for quite a number of years now. Logistically, it just was not feasible. But I've come up with a way of making it feasible, not holsters, but things more like this. Um, and this is just the one thing I had laying around. Uh, this is basically a coin purse, which, okay, guys, it can also be used to carry 22 rounds. And I know that... Uh, uh, the first thing the guys are going to ask is how many rounds can it hold? Well, this little pouch here can hold 500 rounds, 25 at a time. So that's just all I'm saying. But I'm going to be focusing more on the impulse buy market, uh, probably wholesale, obviously, uh, convenience stores and stuff like that. I've been working on the plan for actually a couple of years and displays and stuff like that in my free time, whatever that amounts to. But that's another thing. And I'll probably be carming a few of these before I go, as well as some, some chaga. So that's phase two of my evil, insidious plan to not starve. I hope that's okay with you. And I'm going to dump this card because I know it's going to be ready to run out here any second. So we'll get into phase three in just a minute. What? We're rolling? Um, uh, chaga tea. Tea. Anyway, where was I? Uh, oh, phase three of the Insidious Plan. Uh, I've been trapping for a number of years now, and while I enjoy trapping immensely, it's not really an income. How the, obviously the big trappers know how to do it, but I'm not a big trapper, I'm a little trapper. And, uh, it just seems to me that, um, it's set up for uh, the fur buyers and the auction houses, not the trappers. Uh, because if I were to divide uh, uh, the number of hours it takes me to run the trap line, skin, board, blah, 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 uh, into what I make, um, 
it's pennies an hour, maybe. Uh, just not worth it uh, monetarily, at least the way I've been doing it. Um, and I'm, I'm really not interested in playing into the system anyway. I, I know that the animal rights activists and stuff like that have made it tough for the furriers and stuff. I understand that. Uh, but it, I'm not going to give up, you know, just because uh, uh, a few people are mouthing their opinions and making it politically incorrect to uh, wear the original garment of man, I guess, except for the fig leaf. Uh, you know, uh, furs and, and leather and stuff have been been the, the basic, uh, even felt is, is animal fur, right? Uh, uh, for eons, since the beginning of man. So what I've decided to do is... Anyway, I'm sorry about this clip jump. I, I, I want things to be smooth, but my memory card uh, doesn't last very long in HD, and why I'm filming this in HD when it's going to be seen online, I have no idea. Uh, but uh, the the final phase of, of uh, this this project of, that I'm working on is to excuse me uh, to sell my my furs whole, uh, retail, not wholesale, retail uh, for taxidermy purposes. If people want to, to buy them and have them mounted, uh, if you don't. Uh, have an outdoor lifestyle where you're at or you don't trap but still want a fur for your your gun room or man cave or whatever or if you want just want to have one mounted uh, they're going to be uh, scun for taxidermy purposes or just for display uh, I'll also be selling uh, the skulls uh, set up as either like paperweights or some sort of uh, like mounting for like a walking stick so you could have like an ermine skull on your walking stick or whatever um, so that's that's in the works. That's in the plans. Hold on, I gotta make sure my my Martin doesn't fall. But anyway, um, so that's it. Uh, I gotta wrap this up pretty quick and and dump this card and and we're getting to the closing. We're we're almost done with this video. Uh, thank God. I know you're getting really tired of me going off and stuff. But just a few more minutes of your time, and I promise it'll be worth. Okay, so there you have it. My three-step plan to not starve. I know that's probably a little understated, but, you know, getting rich is just, you know, that's just not like me. But anyway, just to recap, um, phase one was uh, being an Amazon affiliate. Now, below in the descriptions, I mean, everyone who makes these videos goes, in the descriptions, so I have to do that. I think that's mandatory. Um, you will find a link direct to Amazon. And these knives are cheap, and I'm not begging you to buy this. I'm not. I swear to God. Um, <laughs> anyway. Um, Christmas is coming. This would make a great stocking stuffer for that little gal or guy, future hunter, shooter person. Um, and I know you won't be disappointed with this knife. So just, you know, click on the link down there. And if you buy this knife or the stainless steel version or... or any other more knife or whatever, I'll earn a commission on it because I'm talking these knives up so splendidly, you know, that you won't be disappointed. And I'll tell you what, the very first person on the forum that buys this knife and sends me some sort of verification, I'm going to give you one of these 500 round ammo pouches for no charge. 25 at a time. So, so it's like that. So if you would do that, that would be totally awesome. Uh, like I said, I just don't want to uh, think this is a handout. This is the stuff I really do use. And as far as the hides go, this thing here, and the, the chaga, this thing here, um, it's all going to be available next year. And we'll just, well, actually, next year starting January 1st uh, is when this is all going to start kicking in. So just, uh, I really appreciate your support. Uh, this is a direction I never thought I would go in, but dang it, you know, when push comes to shove, a guy has to survive. And you don't want me to end up like this guy. No pressure there, right? Anyway, there's two more videos coming, hopefully, before I check out of here and go back up to the cabin. And then after, you know, the first of the year, there's going to be a whole bunch of stuff coming up. Not just marketing stuff or anything like that or affiliate stuff. Uh, you know, fun stuff, 
uh, for you probably more than me, but uh, I'll uh, drag you and the rest of the world uh, kicking and screaming along with me. And I hope you enjoy it anyway. Uh, it's meant to be fun and entertaining and uh, informative, I guess, to a certain point too. But uh, I'd appreciate it if you'd uh, uh, thumbs up the video. Uh, uh, I pay cash money uh, and or comment. Uh, please comment, share, do whatever. Uh, I made this video specifically for the forum, but it's it is you know for everyone. But I did make it just for you. So with that, I'll let you go. And like I say, no pressure, and I'll see you soon.